Hey guys, it is me, Hypnosarika, and welcome back to Resident Evil 4 Remake. So currently we are located in some sort of a creepy room, but inside of this room we found a map, and it looks like we have to get to another side of the lake. So that's what we're gonna try to do. We're gonna climb down that cellar. I have no idea what we'll find down there, but before we do all of that, I think I found some more secrets. So once we leave that room, and when we go left, check this out. There's this blue note. I haven't checked it yet as I wanted to check it out together with you. So let's see what this blue note does. The traitor's twins should not be allowed to rest in peace for joining that evil cult. Won't someone, anyone, destroy the emblems engraved upon their tombstones? Request destroy the tombstone emblems, area church. We will be able to get to Spinel for doing that. I know exactly where we should go. Let's also get here some more loot. Elegant headdress. A headdress inlaid with rare stones for selling only. Okay, so we can sell that stuff for 7,000 pesetas. Okay, I destroyed one of those things, and there we go, another one. <laughs> well there we go, we have done this grave robber quest. We've got into Spinel. And last time, this thing has exploded. Remember, the huge tower fell, and some sort of a door opened up, and I've never even wandered in here. Okay, let's try to destroy her first, and let's try to disable the alarm. Not the alarm, but the C4 explosive. And hey, while we are looting this building, smash the like button on the video if you'd like to see more Resident Evil videos. Thank you guys for all of your support. Thank you for leaving all the likes. Thank you for leaving all the comments. You are absolutely amazing. There we go. That's what we were searching for. There we go. We've gotten that gemstone. And that is it. We're back in this room with the map. And let's go down this cellar. Whatever this place is. Okay, it doesn't really look like I need to turn on a flashlight here. Alrighty, I am ready to meet whatever zombies here, whatever they're called. Maybe they're not even zombies. Those infected schmucks. I'm ready to meet them. Let's probably open up the door from this side. This way we'll be able to go back. Let's go. Let's remove that bolt. Let's debolt it and let's cross the bridge. Oh, there's something here. Lago Lake. Oh, we're going to that lake. Yes, of course. So that wasn't even a cellar or anything. We're just here now. There we go. I just exploded this guy. I should have quickly taken this sniper rifle and shot him that way. But whatever, that thing worked just well. What I'm gonna try to do is explode perhaps this barrel as soon as this guy gets close to me. There we go. What a schmuck. Uh, let's get this thing and... No, I missed it, guys. You saw yourself. The guy just moved. There we go. This sniper rifle is awesome. This sniper uh, rifle is amazing. Let's get some more pesetas. Okay, there's another dude up the very top. There we go, we just got him. I don't really know if the guy just got stunned or something. But we got that dude. I have upgraded the pistol last time because I thought it's kind of worth it as we have... Yeah, there we go, there's that snake. Oh, okay, just dodged it. Okay. Okay, let's attack it. So yeah, having this knife is awesome. Being able to block that stuff is amazing. There was a snake. Where is the viper? Oh, there we go, there's the snake. I don't want to waste any bullets for it. There we go. We got it. So this thing is going to go for our friend merchant. So how many snakes we have? We have two snakes. Okay, so we'll probably have to sell them. And I think we can also sell them one by one. Okay, whatever. Let's get the rest of the things here. Let's destroy that barrel. I think there's somebody upstairs. Hello? Nope. Nobody's there. I need to quickly learn how to switch weapons. Actually, it is very fast. Look at this. We're with the pistol. And boom, I'm back here. And we're already in the scope mode. Bloody genius. There we go. Let's go upstairs now. And having this knife is amazing. We are going to upgrade the durability because we can block so many. Okay, the guy's going to get this thing. Go on. Get another one. Oh, no. That's not... That That wasn't it. That wasn't it, Chief. Whoever is there. Okay. Schmuck! Oh, there is a... There is one behind me. Okay, I blocked it. Okay, I blocked it again. Okay, melee. There we go. Dude, this knife is amazing! Get the prompt thing. There we go. Now, give me gunpowder. There we go. Drop kick. Okay, so we are getting better. That's it. I think she's gone. That's it. Give me more pesetas. We are seriously pretty good now. And I've gotten zero, zero health damage or anything. We're doing very, very good. Let's destroy this thing. Perhaps another snake inside. Nope. More pesetas. And maybe we'll need to use these flash grenades, perhaps. Let's try to register a shortcut for, like, number, I don't know, seven. Let's try to use more of them. I think flash bangs are going to be good because I've gotten some comments from you guys talking about those flash bangs. And I think it's about time we check them out. Maybe when there are more enemies rather than just one enemy. I don't know. Oh, no. The guy behind me. How on earth did that dude spawn here? Oh, my goodness. 
Seven. Okay. There you go. Okay. Are they dead now or not? I'm getting kind of lost a little bit. Okay. There we go. Let's melee them. And this guy's still alive. How on earth are you still alive? Yes. Anybody behind us? Nope. Go on. Closer. Bam! Schmuck! <laughs> we got it. Those barrels are epic. So far, we've gotten zero damage. That knife is a lifesaver. We seriously need to upgrade that knife to have more durability. Knife is probably insane here. I'm sure there will be people that do like uh, hard mode, knife only speedrun or something like that. Knives are epic and we have to upgrade the durability of it. Like that thing is insane because I think it's going to pay off because the more often we repair it, the more cash we need to spend. So the more durability we have, the less we'll have to repair it unless the repair price will go up. But I think it does not go up. Okay, there's something else here. Perhaps another Viper. Nope, more handgun ammo. All right, so we will somehow some way have to drop down there to get this thing. I will probably shoot it. The gem will fall all the way down there. So we'll have to somehow some way get it. I'm sure we will get down to that lake. Whoa, almost stepped on it. Let's try to remove the thing. Also, some of you left comments that we should maybe lure zombies into this trap. And I totally agree with that, and I have thought about it myself. Except it is pretty hard to lure them there, as there are lots of them. So good luck crouching below that C4 while they run towards you. They might just explode us. But I'll definitely try to lure them into that trap one day. Okay, let's get this. Lots of pesetas, more spinels. Good luck finding someone big enough to use this thing. Ooh, maybe that's a reference to something. I don't know. I don't know. Well, we have gotten a blue thing. Is there anyone who can destroy those blue medallions? The area is polluted by their presence and I can't bear it. Request destroy all the blue medallions. Area quarry slash fish farm. Reward for spinel. That is absolutely necessary and we will absolutely do it. We can already see those things. There we go. One, two, three, four, five. So we will get them. And I don't know why, but Resident Evil 4 has, so far at least for me, one of the most unique vibes in the game because I have played the remakes of Resident Evil 2 and Resident Evil 3. I've played Resident Evil 7 and uh, Resident Evil 8. And so far this game feels different than all of them. They give different vibes and I like it. I like being able to collect here coins, upgrading things. I oh, know, just uh, scared off all of those ravens. I could have gotten so much cash. There we go. What I should have done is just dropped a flashbang because you told me guys that we can probably stun them with a flashbang. Okay. Okay, whoever is there, whoever is growling, I'm ready for it. And hopefully so are you. That's got to be a boss battle. Okay, there's a blue thing. How about I go here? Except I don't want to waste my bullets on this stuff. There we go. I got one. And there's got to be a treasure here. There we go. A red gem, perhaps? Yes, a ruby. I mean, something's gonna happen. I don't like whatever I hear there. I don't like whatever I hear there. <laughs> it is too creepy. Those low grunts. They're crazy. Oh, we can... Oh, I cannot use that. It has to have a bit different key. Okay. We've gotten some more resources. Small. They barely fit here. How does one get to this side? Look at this. Oh, there we go. I see it. We can just climb up. And we can destroy this box. No, I thought that's going to be another viper. Maybe viper is here in the barrels, please. Because I see that purple smoke. So that means the traitor is here. Nope. No snakes. Oh, no. There is no merchant. Why did I think Merchant is here? Uh, whatever. Whatever, maybe my bad. Merchant isn't here. I don't think we missed anything behind us. Oh, I did miss some bullets down there somehow. So maybe we'll go back and we'll get it. But I think it's time for us to progress further. There we go. There's my man. Welcome. <laughs> why not treat yourself, man? Merchant tip, get cash back. Instead of letting your unused guns collect dust, why not sell them and spend the extra cash to upgrade weapons you do use? When you sell a weapon you've tuned up, you'll get almost all the expenses you put into it back. There's no catch, mate. We're just rooting for you. Okay, so it's not that bad. Basically, the game is encouraging you to upgrade the things and then you'll get the cash back. I like it. There are enough weapons here to get a party going. Grenade launchers. Oh, wow. I'll probably sell this oh, elegant God. headdress Ooh, and I'll sell him two of those vipers for the quest. We also have this SG thing, which I should probably sell as it costs only 4,000 and I'm not using this pistol anyway. So I might as well just sell it. Let's try to repair this knife. It is pretty cheap to repair it. 
Let's repair that thing. Let's increase the durability. I know it is 10k, but it's gotta be worth it. Like, I'm upgrading my knife. We need to have as much durability as possible. Let's perhaps craft some rifle ammunition. It is worth it, I guess. Let's do it. Oh, there's an elevator. We are definitely gonna hop in that elevator, except I see a chest. Might as well open it up. And hexagonal APs. Ooh, I will take that. Okay, there are so many other ways where we could go. We can go upstairs. We can go downstairs. We can go in the elevator. So there are three ways for us to explore. And also for those wondering why I don't buy other weapons. I mean, just look at the inventory. We don't even have space to hold those other weapons. Like everything's filled up here. I don't really want to sell anything. We can't store anything. So I'm just going to keep that. Let's sort of go through the door. Wherever this door leads us to. Okay, binoculars. Perhaps I can check that stuff out. We can drop down there. Wow, I haven't explored that place yet. There are so many things for us to explore. Like a ridiculous amount of things. In any case, let's get the binoculars. Okay. We see some things. Yikes. It must have been another police officer. And that's it, they just left. <laughs> there we go, ladies and gentlemen. There we go. What was that? Well, you'll have to fight that, Leon. You'll absolutely have to fight it. Wait, is there anything there? Looks okay, like I just there's found something, something over there. I don't see anything. How do you see something? But we will have to get there. How do you see anything that way? But we will definitely go that way. So it looks like we got to drop down there. But before we do this, as I said, I want to explore other things first. What if I drop down? I feel like if we drop down, I won't really progress here. Maybe I'll just get some more loot. Maybe I'll get more vipers because I need to get one more viper. There we go. A chest. Can't really open it up as we don't have a key. There we go. There's another barrel. Please tell me a viper in the barrel. Nope. I'm sure the vipers were already somewhere behind us and I somehow somehow missed one. And I don't know how that happened. Okay, so we'll have to get something to get here. Perhaps something on this side. Uh, more pizzettas. Oh, there's this dude. Let's get it. 3 out of 16. I am a loot goblin, so over here, guys, I forgot to get some handgun ammunition. Let's get it. And I want to see what's here. Maybe I need to... Yikes. Schmuck, I'm not scared of you. I kind of am scared of that dude. <laughs> I am scared of it. And there's this elevator, so let's try to go in the elevator if it even works. It does work. Okay. Welcome, stranger. Where am I? You can use three silver or golden tokens at the token machine to win a random charm. The more golden tokens you use, the greater your chance of getting a rare charm. Okay, I have zero charms. We will try to get them. There is also a note here. Destroy the pirates and shoot for the high score. Weapons and ammo are unlimited and it's all free. Earn tokens based on your score for a chance to win magnificent prizes. Prizes. Exchange your token for charms at a token machine. They're full of treasures and can be found nowhere else. Tips and tricks. You can destroy several targets at once by shooting nearby dynamite to set off an explosion. Be careful. Shooting a sailor will deduct points from your score. So, I mean, we could hop over here and try to do that target practice and win some things. A single weapon and you'll find yourself out of ammo. All right, let's try it out. Let's go for 1A first. Three, two, I'm ready. One, Looks like we got the... It said to not shoot the sailor. Do I have to shoot the sailors? Yes, I do. Oh, no, I don't have to shoot these ones. Okay, so I don't have to shoot those guys. Okay. Okay. We got the reload time. This is lovely, ladies and gentlemen. A mini game in the game? Okay, so it ain't that bad. This one wasn't that bad. We have gotten almost 5,000 points. We have to gotten two more silver tokens. So how about I go here and I drop these silver tokens. And what did I get? 
got a ball here. Charms can be swapped out via customized case menu at any typewriter. Soldier with stun rod. Plus 15% bolts craft bonus frequency. Okay. So I try to do it one more time. We've gotten 6,000 points. I have gotten three more silver tokens. Let's drop them in. And we've gotten a golden one here. Okay. A Louis Serra rare. Plus 20% weapon resale value. I guess that thing isn't that bad. So now we can attach things equipped to the left here. And let's attach this thing in the center. So we can have multiple charms here at the same time. So now when I open that stuff up and we can see what's going on, we have both of these guys here. And now it's time for us to move forward. Maybe I'll go back there and I'll play some more. But it's time for us to progress. There we go. There will be a bunch of those blue pendants. We'll gather those pendants. We'll gather everything else here that we can find. Oh, we got to go there. Another note. A boat fuel is stored with the generator fuel inside the processing building at the fish farm. Take only what you need. Okay, so we have to get some fuel at the fishing farm. I haven't been here yet. Is that the fish farm? What is this place? Sir, I'm scared. Oh my goodness! Oh, Lord! I did not expect that. I just wanted to, to explore. Now, here we are. Oh, there's the dude. Another one of those schmucks. Okay, I couldn't do it there. I couldn't stop it with the knife. I thought I could stop that stuff with the knife. Okay, that dude is dead now. We got it. Okay, we got her. Didn't mean to use this knife, but we used it anyways. That weapon, I mean. Okay, let's try to melee that dude. Let's try to melee these schmucks. Okay, so upgrading the pistol was worth it, as we can now melee them a little bit faster. Okay. Okay. I just blocked that stuff with a knife. So when they start swinging, all you have to do is just start spamming space, and it works. And it works really well in this game, and I love it. Works really, really well. Let's see, got all of them. So it looked like there's a lot of them, but you just don't have to panic. And once we have enough loot, it's great. Come here, schmuck! There we go, I've been searching for you. We'll get some spinel for it. Nice. Trader's gonna be happy. I think Trader needed that stuff to give it to his friend or something. There we go. All right, we've gotten some submachine gun ammunition, so we should buy a submachine gun, but we need to have a bigger case first. We have here a decent pistol and this Punisher that we have. It's not that bad, especially once we upgraded the damage for it. Reload the weapon, Leon! Oh, wow. Oh, wow. We might just die. Okay, we definitely needed that sniper rifle in time for us to heal. Do I have anything to heal with? I have only a red herb, so let's use this med kit. Okay, that was worth it. Could have exploded that barrel, but I decided to save it. Okay. Okay, I was able to, to dodge it with space knife is great. Knife is awesome! Dude, I love the knife in this game. Once you get the hang of it, knife is everything. Okay. Okay. Look at this. We are just destroying them. I think the default pistol has more damage than this one, but maybe this one is better because they say that it has some um, penetration damage, so I don't know. Okay, there's another one of these schmucks. Do not explode this thing on accident. I don't even want to know how much damage we can get with it. Honestly, don't even want to imagine. I'm also happy that they give us a decent amount of ammunition, so it's not like I have to save here every bullet. It can actually fight them, which that's lovely. Oh, there's another viper. Okay, let's get it. So I'm sure you can use some of those vipers to restore your health and you can sell the rest of those vipers. Okay, so let's go this way and the blue medallion. There we go. Let's get one. So we have four out of five and then there's one more once we go all the way over there. We'll get it. Hexagon piece B. Okay. Okay, so we just have to go forward now. Oh, there's a crow. There's something else here. Some more pezzettas and I don't think I've missed anything. So I try to pick up everything that I could find. We could either climb the ladder or we could open the door. I feel like we should open the door and then we'll climb that ladder later. Come here, whoever is inside of this place. Oh, it's pretty quiet. Lovely. I do hear some snakes around us, though. We've gotten another chicken egg. Let's try to sort out our inventory. It is almost full, guys. It is filled. Basically as filled as it gets. 
There we go. Does it even fit? This yes, at least boat fuel about. gets in our inventory somehow, some way. I'm gonna double, triple check this place. I'm sure on the way back some of the schmucks have spawned in. Oh no. How lovely. So time for us to go up there and we need to deal with those blue pendants. Something up here and we have to disarm this thing. There we go. There's another barrel and I can hear a bunch of those villagers again. Those villager zombies. Why they gotta be like that? I'm almost out of ammunition so I'll have to get them with this sniper rifle perhaps. There we go. There's somebody behind us. There we go. Okay, so we dealt with all of them. It wasn't too hard. Except I haven't been here yet. So let's drop this thing down. And let's take this antique pipe. And look at this. This antique pipe can be sold for 7,000 pesetas. Okay, so we try to get that way and then it just broke. So now we have to go straight as there's only one way to go. Yeah, that's gotta be where we came from. And now we just have to go that way. Let's drop down. It is oddly quiet way too quiet we have some more shapes i think we need more shapes here let's try to insert this piece let's try to insert another piece and once we probably get all of them then we'll be able to mess around with these pieces because i was like wait we don't get the puzzle here i think we will get that puzzle once we insert all the pieces yes more handgun ammunition handgun is awesome plus we've got an, a yellow herb so we can combine this yellow herb probably with the red one and then with the green one the inventory is full 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 there we go there's that blue thing there we go. Five out of five. That's all of them. So we're well back here at the done. trader's place. We've got uh, an, uh, two spinel. And we need just one more spinel. Then we'll be able to buy this laser this sight. So let's wait for it. I don't really know if we need it, but I want it. And now let's sell one more viper because that's what the trader wants. There we go. Now we've gotten four spinel for this viper hunter. Let's get this laser sight. Don't know if I want it, but I've used three spinel on it. I mean it in a good way. Of course. Come back. Is he not happy with it? Does he think I'm an idiot for getting that thing? Let's put it on the Punisher. And is it any good? If it's bad... Okay, so that's it. Maybe we'll be able to get better headshots with this laser. I don't know if it was worth it. Maybe it was just a bad idea. But I got it. Call me crazy, but I think I will sell some of these small resources. Maybe let's sell two of them because we really don't have any space in our backpack. We need some space. How about we upgrade the shotgun? I want it to have more damage. There we go. Let's spend 23 more K on the shotgun. There we go. Now we need to craft some shotgun shells. There we go. I don't really know if that was a good idea, but the dude said that once we sell weapons, we can almost get all of our cash back. So I'm not now scared to upgrade things. If one day we get a better shotgun, I can always sell this one and we'll get all the cash back. It's all good. Now let's hop in the boat, ladies and gentlemen. We have gotten enough fuel. <laughs> Let's go. I'm ready to go on an adventure. With these awesome weapons and with an upgraded shotgun. Sadly, I don't have lots of bullets for that shotgun, so we'll need to do something about that. There we go. <laughs> this is so cool. Will I get to drive the boat? Will I get to click W and ASD? Oh, wow. No. From now on, we have to swim manually. We already know what's gonna happen here. We saw that monstrosity. But is it attracted to like normal things or only to blood? Because those other people came here with the boat and it did not attack the boat. So, who knows? Whoa. The thing is huge and disgusting. Imagine you saw that thing IRL. That's it. My heart stops immediately. Oh, wow. We got attached to it. So, defeat the lake monster. Let's try to throw these harpoons. Okay. Okay. I've done a little bit of damage. Move left and right. Okay. We don't really see the health. So we have infinite harpoons! Should have maybe threw that thing in the mouth or something. Alright. I'm ready for it. Wherever it's gonna come out from. Come here, schmuck. 
Okay, I'm ready. I'm ready. Never been more ready in my life. Never been readier. What am I doing? I just got detached. Ah. Uh, nice. I don't really know how many more hits we have to do. Like. Bro, Leon is crazy. He's talking crap to this huge monster. Imagine that. Imagine being Leon. You thought you could swallow me whole, right? Yeah. There got another harpoon shot. But Leon is badass. One of the most badass characters, probably. <laughs> I love Leon. He's epic. There you go. A few more harpoons. Oh my goodness! Did I get it? Just with a few sticks? Yeah, better get out of here. So I think if I don't throw the Herboon at the right time when that dude attacks me, I think we might be in trouble. Okay, try to avoid that thing with WASD. I've done, got a little bit of damage. Where is it gonna come from? Okay, I'm ready. I'm absolutely ready. Go for one more Herboon throw. Where'd you go? Where'd you go, schmuck? I'm ready. <laughs> I see it. We probably got it. Achievement unlock her poon hurler. Her poon hurler. I have no idea. But I either scared that monster off or I killed it. Regardless, Julian is an extreme badass. Yep. The the gift. The gift in your blood or whatever. It's probably the, the syringe thing. When we met like that weird guy, he injected us with a syringe, so I'm sure that's the case. Would you like to save your progress? Yeah. There go. Let's go for another chapter. Lamb. You will receive our most sacred body. It begins now. When day breaks, you too will join our covenant to share in my holy blessing forever. Okay, we're still good. The boat is kind of broken now. It has holes in it. Look at it. There's water in the boat. You have arrived. Welcome, Leanne. And I didn't even have to waste any of my bullets. Condor one to roost. Do you read me? Condor one? You've been radio silent for three hours. Are you all right? Yeah, I'm fine. Won't let it happen again. And the church? I'm still looking for whatever key I need. Copy that. I'm glad you're okay. Roost out. Okay, I'm glad she didn't push us again. Oh, where's baby eagle? So she kind of did care about us. That's good to know. It's nice to see when humans care about each other. Uh, so we could maybe hop on the boat, find the key to the church. Won't be going anywhere in this thing. <clears throat> Uh, yep. So we barely got here, basically. So there's another boat or something? I don't know. In any case, let's hop through here. Let's go back to the pistol thing. Because the last thing I want to do here right now is accidentally shoot that shotgun when we ha when I have only three bullets. So we have here the police hat. I don't think there's anything special in it. Any hidden gems? Ooh, shotgun shells! We just spoke of the shotgun. I'd love to get a rocket launcher. And boom, we get a rocket launcher. Nothing missed. Skedaddle. Okay, I kind of hear villagers. So which way do I go? Do I go left? Do I go right? Or where do I go? As I want to get all the loot first and then progress. Because that's the smartest thing to do. There you go. Let's sort that stuff out. I don't have a slightest... Okay, so we got to go that way first. I see it. I see. There might be an idiot, but I ain't stupid. 
Okay, they don't even see me. They aren't even here. They're they're down there. Oh, I even forgot about the laser sight. Let's check it out. And now we play during the night. Okay. I think I haven't missed anything. Okay, there's a red herb. So I have missed some stuff. A red herb and nothing else. Whatever. Let's go further, ladies and gents. Let's see what this place is all about. Let's pop some villagers. Let's get some more loot. More pesetas. I see that eye thing. Okay, I got it. So I'm sure that I thing was the weak place, but I don't want to fight these guys again. What the? They're pretty creepy. Okay. Now a head kick. Here we go. Shut your mouth. Oh no, oh no. Oh no! Oh lord! Okay, got it, got it, got it, got it. Melee. Destroyed. Okay, so maybe they're not that hard, but still they're kind of creepy as I'm not sure where to shoot them. They have like those eyes, but it's kind of hard to aim at those eyes. But we got them. Nonetheless, we got them. Wait, what is that golden mark here? What does it say? A church key. Okay. That's the church key. A barrel, though. A marked yellow paint barrel with some more pesetas in it. So we had like 40,000 or something. We were rich. Now we only have 3k. I wish we could buy the rest of the weapons. The SMG or something. But one day we'll get it. Okay, let's go through here. Once again, I apologize if I place? open the map quite often. But it's really easy to miss things. So, let's hop here. Some kind of shrine. Okay. But we'll check it out. Perhaps something useful. Same mark from the church. Alrighty. So we'll have to give, like, probably two sacrifices here. Okay, so yeah, we'll have to add those things and then we'll get that thing to get to the church okie dokie anything missed nope so we'll have to find a way to it's drop the those things there's the lake and we can see that monster drawn <clears throat> in that picture okay investigate two locations which locations so we have to go here location from mural and there is another location all the way up there location from mural <clears throat> Are there any locations? One there and one there. Okay, I see it. So we are probably investigating those things. Let's go now down here as I don't think there's anywhere else we can go. If there's anything else I can't explore. Loot. Old Way Shrine Key. I'm sure it's not something for sale. It's a, it's a key item. Definitely, that's got to be a key item. Where is it? Yep, that's a key item. A key of intricate design used to unlock the wooden way shrines scattered throughout the village. Okay, I will get them. Plus, we've gotten another note. Another request note. I like it. Some fetch me a rare gold chicken egg. What will you do with it? Well, sometimes it's more fun not knowing, right? So we have to find him an egg and we will get three spinel for it. Alrighty. So I don't think there's anything we have missed. Let's up in the boat. I don't think we need even fuel for this one. Okay, so, so we accelerate that, so we reverse. So I can't really move my mouse left and right. We can only look straight. So how about we destroy this thing? We've gotten some more pesetas. So we'll be able to get back to this guy. Okay, but before we do this, maybe I don't even need to get back to that guy. I'll just get my loot on my own. Wait, I haven't been here yet. There's more loot. All right, there we go. Let's climb out at this spot. Don't really know if we have to do it, but it looks like there's something here. So might as well just check that stuff out. Okay, the door is locked. Cannot what go that way. There's got to be something. Shut your mouth! What are you... Didn't your mom teach you not point fingers? Oh, no. Uh, the Granado! The Dinamito! Is gonna explode. Oh, no. No! Whoa! The Dinamito helped us out! Thank you! Whoever threw that Dinamito... Oh no, I missed it. I missed it. There we go. That's guys what we, why we bought this thing. Maybe it ain't only that reason, but it's the main reason. Let me tell you that. Oh my goodness, I couldn't do the knife thing. Oh wow, they have evolved now. So all of them just become like that. Okay, we got it. At least they're not that strong. Or we have a really strong weapon now. There we go, now I got you. 
now I gotcha. Oh no, a Molotov! Almost got set on fire with it. But tried to... There we go. There's somebody behind me. Nope. I thought there's somebody behind us. There is somebody else. Dude, this pistol is so good right now. I am telling you. Look at this! That's what I'm talking about! The sniper rifle is amazing! That's just exactly what the doctor ordered. Ooh, and another yellow herb to get some more health. Hell, yeah. Hell yeah, let's get it. Can I destroy this? Okay, maybe that wasn't a smart idea. Maybe I should have set that thing on fire once we had more enemies. Okay, there's something here. Let's get another one of those uh, velvet blues. Okay, so there's like some sort of a wall with yellow markings. Maybe we have to go up. Maybe we'll have to explode that wall later. Anything useful? Okay, we'll have to solve a puzzle for this one. Oh, there we go. There are the signs here. I see it. Okay, so let's go further. I see another one that's just a kind of random circle thing. So I'm trying to draw all of those kind of signs because I've already seen two signs. That's a third one. Because there was the first one. This is the second sign and they go like this basically. So this is the first one. Then this is the second one. The third one is probably this. Oh, that's it. All we have to do is just enter three signs. All right. Uh, okay. That was easy. Let's get this head. Apostate's head. Okay, let's get one. Yikes. Yikes. So we've obtained one apostate's head. We need to get probably another one. Oh, I'm absolute genius. I thought we'll get more of them. I thought there will be eight signs. I just wanted to show you guys that we found some of them. Okay. There we go. Okay. Both of them fell and there's some schmucks behind us. There we go. There we go. Let's hop in the boat. So we haven't been there yet. Let's go straight. There we go. Some more loot. More pesetas. Nothing that way. So we just need to park the boat here. Let's see what else we can find here. And maybe that's the... No, that's not the way. Because then we'll have to go all the way up. We'll have to get to the lake. We'll have to get there. And then we'll have to swim on that boat all the way there. To get another apostate's head. Okay. I don't think I can use this key yet. Oh, I can! It works! What did we get? A splendid bangle. Ooh, we can add some goodies to it. Okay, so we can't even add those things here. We can only add a green one. Wow. Okay, I understand how it works. We'll need to search for more gemstones then. Alexandrite. Let's get that Alexandrite. Where's Sirecrite? Two collar bonus, 1.1. So we can sell this thing for a bit more. We're gonna get 16,500 pesetas. Okay. I think I just realized something. So when it says duo, it doesn't mean that you have to have two red ones. You can have two blue ones. You can have two yellow ones. So it does not matter which colors. Okay, I understand now. And let's try to get another apostate's head. Okay, we haven't been here yet. Probably. I mean, more barrels. And more pesetas. And you know me. Oh, wow. <laughs> That's a lot of loot. So we are back in the big lake. So first of all, let's go to the middle of it. I want to explore this side as it looks like we can get some treasure here. And you know me. I'm all about that treasure. I think there's something behind us. There we go. Let's park the boat and let's get that treasure. Look at that. There's something here. Uh, Alexandrite. So we can definitely remove the red one, the red gem from that crown, and we can sell those Alexandrites. I'm sure there's more stuff around this place. There's a blue box. A revolver! Red nine. Ooh. All right, let's try to craft these things. Let's combine them. There we go. I think I was able to take it. There we go. Now it fits. So we have this thing. What kind of bullets do we even need? Let's try to register a shortcut on number four. I, for example. Oh, it still uses the same bullets. How much ammunition I can fit inside of it? Eight. So yeah, same bullets, same everything. I just want to know how much damage we do. Maybe we'll just sell the Punisher and we'll just use this pistol. Maybe. Because we can absolutely do it. Oh no, probably we won't be able even to keep this thing. A powerful handgun, a large red nine is burned into the grip to prevent the user from loading incorrect ammo. But it even says here that I can only use this laser sight on SG-09R or Punisher. 
so I can't really use it on anything else. Maybe I won't use this thing. I'll use it for now to just use eight bullets on it, and then we'll get a different weapon. We can sell this Alexandrite for 6,000 pesetas, and there we go. Now let's add another one. And now we can sell this thing for 19,200 pesetas, which is better in my opinion. Totally better. It is better maybe to save these purple ones for a trio or a quartet as this way we'll get more value out of it so maybe when an item has only two slots to inlay those gems i think we should sell cheaper gems and we should keep those more expensive gems for something better for items that require like maybe three or four inlays like three or four of those gems okay i still have those spears do i need them i mean probably they gave me spears. I probably need them. Say, my goal is to use up like seven or something bullets because I don't want to waste them and then we'll get back to my other pistol. <laughs> something useful in the barrel. Nope. Okay, there's another door. We'll have to solve this puzzle and I don't know this puzzle at all. Okay, so I've written down this third one and I'm sure there are more things. Probably we'll be able to get here once we unlock that door from the down. Oh, check this out. This thing applies as one. I see it. I see this thing goes in part with this one. So it's this one, then we got water, and then the triple sign thing. There we go, we did it. Genius brain. You might say that, hey, psychic, it wasn't hard, but no, 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 it's, it's extremely hard. I'm just very smart. Thank you very much. Thank you. Let's get another apostate's head, except this is a different one. Blast from his head. Let's get it. Whatever. Another hexagonal sea piece. Ooh. So we've gotten everything. Now we can probably go in the church. Maybe we can just destroy this thing. Let's get another ruby. And I like these little puzzles. Again, they're kind of obvious, but they're pretty interesting. Before we go to that church, I think it would be nice to hop here. Maybe those were not people. Wait, I think I imagined something that was just a torch. Oh, wait, that's where I've gotten my first ever boat. No? There we go. Let's try to insert this thing now. And let's try to solve the puzzle. I mean, it's got to be pretty easy, I guess. As you just got to do like this, and... There we go, we did it. What do we get inside of here? Depraved idol, let's get that thing. I think we can sell it, probably. What else we could do with it? Oh, there we go, for selling only 15,000 cash. So we've gotten all of those hexagonal pieces just for this. Oh, these things, you can kill them? Do I get anything for that? Okay, I, I can pick that stuff up. Oh, wow, it is huge. A rare longer sized bass measuring over 18 inches. Can be sold at a high price or used to restore a large amount of health. Doesn't fit here at all, I'm sorry. I'll need to do something with this pistol, then I'll have to come back here and sell that thing. So we can fish to sell that stuff for a decent amount of cash. And there's one more thing that we haven't checked out yet. Let's hop here. Perhaps a golden egg. We see lots of basic eggs. But how about a golden egg? A basic egg. A brown egg. And that's it. We are out of space. Oh, there we go. There's that golden egg. Let's maybe increase our maximum health because it'll increase your maximum health. I think we can use that. There we go. Now I can get this golden egg. And there's a velvet blue. Let's get that one. Okay, so we've gotten everything from this island. Oh, wow. I haven't been here yet. Lakeside Settlement. Do I have to be here? Log the drawer. I mean, I'll get these guys. All right. Is it any better? I don't know if this pistol is better or not. But I just spent a late. I just got in a laser sight on my Punisher. I have been here and we have explored some of it. I don't think we can still go here as. Nope, that doesn't work. The key is not the right one. Oh, that did work. We've just opened it up. Whoa. Whoa, that is the right key. Okay, more notes, but my inventory is filled, filled. We need more loot. Could someone catch a gigantic fish that lives in the lake for me? Fish oil has many uses after all. This photo should help you find it. Sell a laker bass. Okay, we'll get four spinel for this one. I wanted to get it already. Okay, there's a prisoner. Obviously, that's not her. Uh, what the hell is going on here? I have no clue. Maybe let go of that head. Okay, there's a ladder. Let's climb up. Oh, wow. That's a huge ladder. Wait, is that her? 
No, that's not her. I almost thought I all I thought it's Ashley because we are searching for Ashley here, so I thought it's her. We've gotten a small key. I don't think there's anything else here we can just drop down. Wait, I can hear something. More wolfos? Apparently. Oh no. Oh lord. Nope, I don't think he is kidding you. That's absolutely right. How about I go up? Whatever is over there! Whoa, 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 whoa! Okay. Okay, that's not good at all. I think we can eat some of these eggs to restore some of our health. Okay, we got another one. Reload the shoddy. I'm sorry. It is what it is. I mean, there's nothing to say sorry about. These are monsters. Look at them. These ain't no wolfos or pooches. Wait, there's something here and we have a key. I have this special key. Can I use it? Yes, indeed. What do we have inside of here? Pearl something. Pearl bangle. And this pearl bangle can be sold for 12,000 cash. Lovely. You can also hop inside of this house. And check this out, we have a key. So let's open up one of these chests. And a gold bar, a literal gold bar. A gold bar for 10,000 cash, a small chunk of gold for selling only 10k cash, wow. 10k pesetas. And I did not see that there is a door. I kind of remember being here. Is it like very beginning of the game? Yeah, that's gotta be very, very beginning of the game. Because for some reason, I don't remember everything, but I do know that there was something else. Three years ago, my beloved daughter passed away shortly after giving birth to a son. Since then, the boy was grown considerably. He's a very curious child and has a true thirst for knowledge. He even tries to follow after me when I go out hunting. I can't take my eyes off him for a second. Whenever we talk in the forest, he always asks me to tell stories. He's very fond of Don Quoxote. Although he's still small, the boy's smart and observant beyond his years. If he were and stuck here, he might have become a scholar. I was a careless fool. I could have sworn I shot clean through the wolf's head until it lunged at me. I was able to make it back to the cabin, but the wound is swollen and discolored. I cannot bear seeing the boy's worried eyes. My body moves on its own, and I can hear voices in my head. Am I going mad? I can't die now and leave the boy behind. Dear God, please protect him. Okay. A red gemstone ring. Okay, for selling only 6,000 cash. Actually, possess us, not cash. I don't know why I keep calling it cash. Got some new ways, stranger. Okay. For a treat. Because it's a new chapter and we are back here at the Welcome. trader's place. So let's sell him everything that we don't need. For you. But first of all, let's check this out. So we can get a bolt thrower and it's more expensive now. What so we should have taken that deal. It does not get cheaper. It just gets more expensive. If you have that deal, you should take it because I don't think you'll get a better deal. So bolt thrower is back to 10k as it was 8k. We can buy this new case upgrade and we should definitely buy it. Like it's it's, it's a no brainer. We have to get it. There is a rocket launcher for 80,000 cash, but I can't even buy it. Let's try to repair the knife. We definitely Good need to repair to it. Let's try to sell him a golden egg because he wanted it for some sort of a quest. There we go. Let's sell it. So he wants it. Plus we're going to get 10k cash and we'll get some more things. Oh, wow. Let's go for it. You're a real professional. <laughs> Plus, we've gotten three spinels, well, so we can buy this thing. TMP stock and elegant mask, which oh, is probably oh, worth buying, silly. and a high power Here's scope. A metallic black attache case increases the drop rate of rare resources. I don't think we need it. All right, so let's start selling some things. Let's sell this insignia key. Let's sell the antique pipe. So we are going to get 59,000 just for that. Let's sell it. <laughs> So I just got a fish here, Lunker Bass. Let's sell it. Plus, we're even going to finish some sort of a request here. Let's sell that. 5k cash, more spinels. I'm also going to sell this splendid bangle. I know it's probably more worth it to save those purple gems, but I'm just going to sell that stuff and that's it. There we go. We are at 106,000 pesetas. So check this out. We have this Punisher and we have this Red 9. So Red 9 does more damage than this other weapon, but it does not have that red laser sight, so... Do I want the red laser? So now, finally, we can buy this case to upgrade it. Let's buy this huge case. Look at this. Now we have more space. We've got an extra bottom row. Amazing. <laughs> Amazing. I think it's time for us to buy this TMP. Let's go. You cut through the crowd with that. Let's perhaps upgrade this TMP. There we go. There we go. We can always sell that thing later. Let's perhaps get this TMP stock as well. Expensive. And let's buy this elegant mask. I'm sure we'll need it. Let's add now three gems into this elegant mask. 
and we can sell this thing for 23,000 cash. There we go, 23k cash, baby. Thank you for that. We're back at 71,000. Oh, wow. Whoa. This thing is huge. It makes no sense to have it. Whoa, we don't even have lots of... Look at this. It was not worth it to buy this weapon. It was not worth to buy that weapon at all. I regret it. Well, we still have a little bit of storage once we sort things out. We still have some space here, but... Yikes. And we will be able to craft some more submachine gun ammunition, so let's craft it to test it out. I mean, I bought it. You might as well just test that stuff out. We still have lots of cash. I might as well just upgrade this rifle. There we go. So it took me over 40 minutes to gather all of those resources and sell all of that stuff. But I'm sure it was worth it. We have now a weapon and other cool stuff. Let's drop the thing. So which kind of thing we have to add here? I don't even know which one. I don't think it matters. There we go. It does fit. It fits here perfectly. Let's add another one. There we go. Church insignia. Let's get it. Oh, somebody called us. Oh, no, we were calling them. Condor Wonder Roost. I found the key to the church. Copy that. Now go get Baby Eagle. Right, <laughs> Baby Eagle. No time to chat. I'm going in. Condor one out. That's it. Let's go get her. Let's go get Baby Eagle. I'm kind of excited to check this weapon out because we can kind of... <clears throat> Shoot precisely, because we bought this stock. I've spent lots of uh, resources on it. Now we need to find our way back to the boat, and we need to get to the church somehow, some way. All right, so we got to go back here through the quarry, and then we'll get back to that church. Let's go for it. We have all the weapons. We have everything, and I just realized something. There we go. The game just saved. Yeah. You know what's up. There we go. I knew it! <laughs> I knew it. And of course, the door is locked everywhere. Rudy! I got new weapons. I do not have a rocket launcher. But we'll get it one day. We'll get more cash. We'll sell some garbage that we don't need. Maybe we should have, like, sold the Punisher and kept the Red Nine. Oh, wow. This dude reminds me of something. Of some maybe troll from other game. I don't know. Okay. Let's just spray this dude. That's it. Let's reload. That's it? Is that all the bullets? Okay, just avoided that. That's it? Oh, wow, 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 wow. You got it's one too? Yep, they do. Well, is that it? Wait, don't tell me that was the boss fight. The pooch is gonna help me out. No! Oh, it's gonna help me out. F melee! There we go. Oh, we have to knife attack it now. Nothing's gotta happen to that doggo. Doggo's my best friend right now. Well, that's all I have to say. Okay. No! Don't hurt the doggo! If you hurt it, you... Doggo, go away! I appreciate your help. I could use it. Did you say that he can use every help? That's what I'm talking about. Good okay. Boy. Oh no, I missed it. I missed it. I missed it again! I missed it. We need to reload. Dude, I'm glad that I upgraded the sniper rifle. Oh my goodness, it keeps moving! I wasted so many shots on this thing. You have no idea! There we go! It was so hard to hit that worm thing. There we go, let's melee it. I'm so sad I wasted like... Three, four shots. Without the sniper bullets, it'll be very hard. Okay, let's reload. Oh no, I only have three more bullets left. There we go, another shot, baby. This time I try to be more precise. I try to be more careful. We got the boss. <laughs> We've upgraded the weapons and we just slayed this boss. No problemo. Yellow diamond, okay. It's almost a pancake. Oh, it was almost a pancake. Okay. Don't worry, I like pancakes. Let's get to that church. Where's the pooch though? Please tell me everything's fine with the pooch. Please tell me I'll see the boots at the end of the game. We've gotten some submachine gun ammo, other stuff. And more loot here. Okay. 
Okay, that submachine gun maybe isn't that bad. Probably not bad at all. Where are you? Oh, welcome me! Hello, thank Thanks, you so boy. much! Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you! Have a great day, sir, mister, mistress, whatever you are. Thank you. You are literally the best pooch ever. I wish I could give you some food. Like, if I could give you a fish, I would literally go right now and fish there. Well, that's it. I don't think I've missed anything else. I've picked up everything I could. And this yellow gem costs 7,000 pesetas. Ooh. Not too shabby, not too bad. Okay, let's try to reload the weapon that we have. Our TMP. We've just had a boss battle, so I doubt that... Oh, no. Okay. So we got it. Dude, this TMP isn't bad. Oh, except we need to... Okay, come back, schmuck! Oh, that's it. We got it. Could have been faster if I had used that pistol there. Maybe it's not that... But, I mean, maybe it is bad. I mean, just think about it. Use 30 bullets to deal with that one schmuck. It's a lot of bullets. Let's use the ski. Let's use the church insignia and let's get inside. Ooh. Let's open the door. Open the door. <laughs> open the door. Ashley Graham. I'm here oh, to wow. help. I'm here to help. Let's sort everything out and let's probably combine some of the things. This with that. We don't have any yellow herbs. But look at this. It's huge. This DMP stock is huge. Why is it so big? I thought it's gonna be smaller. Definitely it is way too huge. Submachine gun ammunition. At least we're getting more submachine gun ammo here. So we need to find Ashley. Ashley, here I come. A blue dial. Ooh. Alright, so let's loot this entire place. Let's get everything we need to get. Let's find Ashley. And you know what? I am thinking that we should sell this pistol. It does less damage. I don't know why I reloaded it. I just want to use up all the bullets. We've gotten some bolts, which I still don't have. Okay. A suitcase that I cannot open up. But I do love this red dot. It's so good. Why can't I attach that red dot to the other weapon? We've gotten another small key, which we need. Okay, we can here pull a lever. Do I pull that lever right now or... I try to use the key here now. Okay, I cannot do it anyways. There it goes. So let's pull the lever. Oh, and we just needed that blue thing. Will it be some sort of a puzzle? Another puzzle. I like puzzles. There we go. Let's add it. And it doesn't work. Oh, we need to rotate it. Oh, yikes. So we're almost done. I just keep moving that shape little by little. I definitely took more time than I should have on this puzzle. There we go. It should work now, I guess. There we go. We finally did it. I think we probably like five, maybe ten minutes just spinning those things. Like, it wasn't that hard. It's just that, I don't know, it was kind of confusing. I don't know. In any case, we did it. I did it. Well, whatever. Let's go through the door now. The door is open. And maybe Ashley. here we will you in there? finally find Ashley, a.k.a. Baby Eagle. <laughs> Where is it, Baby Eagle, a.k.a. Ashley? No space for the grenades. Unless I craft some more ammunition, more submachine gun ammo. Let's go. Now we have more space and now it can't take that grenade. I don't really know if we needed more submachine gun ammunition. Maybe basic pistol bullets are better. And I believe that basic pistol bullets are better, but still. Let's get... We got in a phone. That's got to be definitely her phone. Look at it. It's pink. It's definitely her phone. We've obtained a file. Okay, so we'll be able to boost that stuff. So I'm sure we'll be able to boost up here with her. There we go. Let's go through the door. Unless she's still not here. Ashley. Ashley Graham, are you in here? Just let me go. Listen. Easy with that. My name's Leon. I'm here in the president's quarters and... <laughs> Look at <That> Leon. Well. <laughs> Wait, I haven't looted the, lo the roommate. I saw some loot there. Hey, it's dangerous outside. You need to listen to me. What is that? Over there? Uh, bad people. So we both have those visions. So he controls them. Salvation. <laughs> that creepy schmuck. 
We will get all of them. I haven't loaded the room. Chapter ended. So now I'm quite certain the merchants are gonna sell us even more things. What do we do? Your father trusts me. And I need you to trust me too. And do exactly as I say. I'm gonna get you <laughs> oh, yeah. I know that sounded weird and funny for some reason. Your father trusts me. I mean, her father is the president himself, so. And I have a TMP, so. I'll get all of them. All right. Oh, that's it. We are in the game. Get the hell out of here. We are definitely going to get the hell out of here. So before we do that, we got some more things to do. We have to hop in the room. And this room has got to have something. There was a typewriter down there and I didn't even see it. That typewriter had some gems in it. I did not even see it. Does her room have anything? Oh my goodness. So you'd stayed here. I get it. They heard it. I had to get that yellow diamond though. Oh, here we can boost up. Oh, that's it. There you go. Boost up the ladder. Okay. Just do it. Just get the ladder. I don't even think they can get here because the door is locked right now. That's it. She just left. Can she get any damage? Because I do know that the in the original Resident Evil 4, she was a little bit annoying had to take care of her as she could get damaged, but we'll see. I am Liam. I take care of people. Attachable minds, uh, whatever. I still don't even have that bolt thing. Even if they gave it for free, I wouldn't want it because I don't have space for it. Like, look at my inventory. Ashley, look at my inventory. Here, check this out. It's full. It's full with loot. Are you impressed? Wait, what if I shine the light on her? She's like, don't shine it. And there was seriously that saving typewriter and I don't know why I did not go there. Does not matter, I guess. No way. It's okay, I've got you. <laughs> Let's go. Just fall like a sack of potatoes, I'll catch you. It's fine. Hey, trust me. How on earth did Leon drop down there? I mean, it's Leon. Let's not question that. He fights God knows what kind of monsters. Just... Just jump head down. I think she died there for a second. Thanks. Rest in peace, Leon's back. Rest in peace, Leon's kneecaps. Rest in peace, Leon's everything. But it is what it is. Roos, I've secured Baby Eagle. Copy that. Is she okay? Affirmative. Well done, Condor One. I'll dispatch a chopper ASAP. I'm sending you the coordinates for the extraction point. Make your way there, and don't let anything happen to Baby Eagle. Copy that. I Hurry. don't think she worse. had to say that, Burst but out. whatever. Okay, let's remove mm -hmm. this thing. Head for the extraction point. The game is just saved. And hey, me and Baby Eagle, we're going to continue the adventure in the next episode. So subscribe to not miss that video. The game's just getting better and better. And now we've gotten the coordinates for the chopper. And it's all the way there. So yeah, we'll try to get there. And I highly suggest you check it out my Resident Evil 8 Let's Play. Or click on the second card to my Resident Evil 7 Let's Play. Or hop over to my channel, go to playlist. And there you'll find a lot of other games that are played here on the channel. If you're not subscribed yet, definitely make sure to drop a subscribe button and notification bell to not miss any future videos. And consider following me on Instagram or Twitter at Epicyric. Mm-hmm. Yep.